There are, of course, uh, quite a few films that have been made on the mobile before uh, this one. Um, actually, I heard, I haven't seen it, I heard ab about a film that's supposed to be very beautiful. It's an Italian film about fear. I think it's called La Paura. Obviously, um, it's a bit of a niche market, and uh, it's true that it's not really being taken seriously always. Because, and I don't think, I mean, the fact that, the, of course, for me, it was important to do it on a mobile in terms of what I wanted to achieve, but um, if you want to do something else, you, you might have chosen other means. It's just a, uh, the right instrument for the right situation. And uh, people actually ask me, are your next film going to be on a mobile too? It doesn't make much sense necessarily, you know. I think I might, I like the, 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 the smallness of it and the easiness to, and also the image quality in this case. But um, it needs to be functional in terms of the content of what you're trying to achieve. So there was not a, a, a directly conscious uh, uh, attempt to uh, say to myself, uh, uh, I'm going to make a film on the mobile. It was just the mobile was used like a notebook. And um, then, however, I, I fell into the story or the story fell into place because I met people and things began to happen and I w it was on the mobile phone. So I thought, um, it's, I'm already in the film, the film has already started and now I can't go back and, you know, be, be come back with another camera, it, this would, I would have lost the moment. So I really got into, um, yeah, into using this camera and uh, enjoying uh, the, the, the flexibility of it and, uh, and also the, how should I say, the, the, the it's a camera that, that belongs to your personal space, so it's not very invasive. Once you use it, uh, people accept it. And it's almost like a d democracy, uh, meaning that anyone has a camera. So they could, co in, in, in effect, they, one could also film me and start a film, so I have two films. But so th there is this kind of uh, psychological um, uh, sp quality to, to filming on a mobile that I enjoyed. One shouldn't see it as a as a as a genre because it, I I just see it as a camera and a camera you always have on you and that makes that 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 borderline very blurry between um, we're having a conversation right now I can pick out my phone and start filming without interrupting the situation and 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 if you in the film when I was working with my actors and my my subjects or my characters how you want to call it. Um, they didn't realize anymore in terms, it was so present all the time that um, it, it fluidly sort of blended into the situation without electrifying it the way, you know, you suddenly come in with a camera and the situation is different, you know. <laughs> now, with the mobile phone, it, it stayed in the same kind of conversational tone, which made it also very difficult for the editing sometimes and for the sound quality and so forth. This